So, how you doing? I'm doing great. Yeah. I'm you doing great. What was what was what did you take away from yesterday? Was that a defeat for you? No, uh, absolutely not. And this is not about me. The yesterday, what happened? Um, I couldn't get to to 41, and I'll be the first one to admit it because there were members that, uh, for one reason or another, could not make it. So I fell uh, basically a member short. So, but you know what? You you. I postponed it to Wednesday, but I, what I've said to you and I've told to everybody that I've talked, for me, this bill was putting out a compromise of something along the lines of what I thought could be a sensible bill, a skeleton of what we can work from. And I told that to my caucus yesterday. And then at one point when we back, went back in the caucus, I asked every member, I said, uh, can anybody vote here today for the Senate bill? Not one hand went up. And that you can confirm with any member. Not one hand went up. So that tells me that that bill is dead. So what happens is we need to negotiate. Then I had suggested I'll clear my calendar Friday, Monday, Tuesday, and we have a voting session. We move the voting session to Wednesday. We will have a bill up that is a bill that we can all live with. The caucus will be happy to pass. But also, I asked, you know, the Senate should be included. Uh, the majority leader yesterday tried to put something together for today. Uh, apparently, it was put together, but then the Senate president says he knew nothing about it. He actually accused me of me saying anything, and I never talked to a reporter, right, somebody so else. somebody else talked about it. So that just tells you the unwillingness and I would Don't say, you need him here. Of course, he should be here because it has to pass. But they need us also. Remember, without us, it doesn't get done. So if now my caucus, this is this bill, and I have many members. We put a nice coalition from throughout the state together to work on what should the bill look like, and then that bill, then we're going to work with the Senate on it. They should be here today. But if they're not, listen, they need us as much as we need them. And so that's just bottom line. Is this going to be a, a, a three day, uh, three days of meetings, or you think you're going to be able to get something today? I don't know. That that'll be hopefully. Uh, would love to get something today, have something already. But if it takes, you know, uh, the next three days, that that's fine too. And listen, this is what we get elected to do. Uh, and I was put in a position to lead. This is what you're supposed to do. You're supposed to protect the interests. I have done my due diligence talking to residents, to uh, organizations, to the governing body of that city. So this is not something that we're just throwing something against the wall and see what sticks. We gave some guidelines. And what I have said frustration from especially maybe the media, nobody has questioned and looked at that bill. In this country of a great democracy, how do you give power to one individual without any oversight that will take the civil liberties away from that town? Nobody talks about it. And I'm frustrated about that because that, you know, from especially the countries that, that we come from, you know, that, that goes in those countries that people don't have a voice. You know, how are we allowing that to transpire in this state? So I think that that needs to be looked at, that that's the biggest flaw in that bill. I know, you, bill. I, I know you got to go in and get to work, but lastly, will you create a bill out of here and bring it to the Senate president for him to look at afterwards? That, that, is, that is our goal, a, a bill that can pass our caucus, and we're having input from every corner of the state, and then hopefully we can work with them. We, you know, I welcome them to be part of the process, but if they take us up on it or not, I don't know. All right, can we talk to you later? Sure. All right. Absolutely. Thanks. Take care. Thank you.